Hello, my name is Rashad Andrews, and I will be explaining how to exploit port 139 and 445, which is SMB. I'm going to begin by opening the terminal of the target machine and pinging the host machine to make sure there's connectivity. Next, I will be pinging the target machine from the host machine to also make sure there is connectivity. Next, I want to clear the terminal, then type in SMB client space minus L space forward slash then the target IP address of the target machine. Refer to my last video on how to find the password on open ports. Take note of the TMP share name and the type, which is a disk. When on a red team and performing penetration tests on a system, try to find obvious clues like oh no's in the comments or the version being used, which is Samba. Next, we're going to type in MSF console into the terminal. Next, we're going to search for a Samba SIM link, which is System Link for short. Scroll up, and you'll find an auxiliary for the System Link directory traversal. Type U0 for more efficiency, and then type Show Options. Notice the requirements needed for this auxiliary. We're going to set the remote host to the target machine's IP address. Show options to make sure the remote IP address was set. Take note of the SMB target is root FS, which is the root file share. Next, set the SMB share to the TMP disk that we identified earlier. Show options to make sure the TMP was actually inputted. Type the exploit command to run the auxiliary. Exit the MSF console and clear the terminal. Next, type in SMB client space forward slash forward slash and the target system's IP address forward slash TMP. Type in the password gathered from earlier. You are now logged in as anonymous and type ELS to view the current directory. The auxiliary executed earlier added the root file share to our directory. Type CD root FS. Next, type ELS to view the current directory. I am Red Team Student 1, so I will change the directory to Red Team 1. Next, I push ELS to view the content of the directory. Then, I change the directory to Student 1. Then press ELS to view the content of the directory. The mypass.txt file contains my hash. Next, I will type git mypass.txt to download that file into my system. Next, type exit to leave the SMB client and clear the terminal. Then type cat space mypass.txt to view the contents of the file. Then type john space mypass.txt to find the password. But the password can't be found because I already used this to find the password before. So to view the hash already found, type cat space dot john forward slash john dot pot. To remove the cracked password, type rm space dot john forward slash john dot pot. Thank you for joining me on this journey. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe and have a good day.